Hey friends, so last night, Mrs. Crow made some jello for dessert. Mmm, it was my favorite flavor too, orange jello. And that reminded me of a poem. It goes like this Jello in the bowl, jello in the bowl. Wiggle waggle, wiggle waggle, jello in the bowl. Can you try that? Let me hear. Great. Now I have something fun I want to try with it. We're going to add some wiggle waggles like this. Jello in the bowl, jello in the bowl, wiggle waggle, wiggle waggle, jello in the bowl. Ready, set, now you try. Great. Now, watch, I'm going to change one more thing. Ready? Jello in the bowl, jello in the bowl, jello in the bowl. Ready? Set? Now you try. Great! I think it would be fun if we try the rhythm with our hands, with our body. So let's move to the floor. All right, now we're going to say the words and clap the words too. Since it's a little bit harder than just saying it, we're going to go a little bit slower. It should sound just like this. Jello in the bowl. Jello in the bowl. Wiggle, waggle, wiggle, waggle, jello in the bowl. Ready, set, now you try. Great. Let's try putting it on our knees now. It should sound just like this. Jello in the bowl. Jello in the bowl. Wiggle waggle, wiggle waggle. Jello in the bowl. Ready, set, now you try. Great! Now let's try one last thing with our bodies. We're going to keep a steady beat on the floor. I have some nice carpet. You might have a hardwood floor, maybe like a table. Either way, it's okay. Maybe you have linoleum too. Try it on different surfaces and see what different sounds you get. Okay? Get the beat going like this. Now it should sound like this. Jello in the bowl. Jello in the bowl. Wiggle waggle, wiggle waggle. Jello in the bowl. Ready, set, now you try. Great. All right, before we try it on instruments, we're going to split into two groups to play the steady beat on the floor and the words on our hands, okay? So if you don't have two beats at home, you can either be on one screen or the other doing that part, and then you can try it again and switch, all right? So get into two groups, choose which side you're going to be with. Ready? Let's get the beat. Set. Add the words. Jello in the bowl. Jello in the bowl. 
Wiggle, waggle, wiggle, waggle, cello in the bowl. All right. If you want to, go back and switch teams. Otherwise, we're going to add instruments. All right, let's add some instruments. I'm going to put the steady beat on a drum. Again, if you don't have instruments at home, you can find a different surface to strike, or you can still play on your body if you would like. Here's the challenge, too, besides adding the drum. We're going to think the words. We're not going to use our mouth or our voice anymore. Just the instruments or your body or whatever it is you choose, okay? So think the words and play the beat. Ready, set, here we go. Great. Now we're going to think the words, play the beat on the drum, and we're going to add the word rhythms on another instrument. I'm going to use claves over here. Claves are uh, wooden sticks that when they hit together, they sound just like this. If you have wooden sticks in your backyard, you can try those, or you can find something else that you can strike together. Okay? Let's get the beat going first. Ready, set, just the beat. Now add the words only on the instrument. Great, we're going to add one more challenge. The last instrument I'm going to add is a triangle to give a different sound. We've got a drum, something made out of wood, and now something made out of metal. Okay? We're going to add those on the very, um, let's add them on the long sounds. So on bowl, okay? On the word bowl. All right. Steady beat. That goes first. Great. If you want to try that again, go ahead and rewind. If you want to try a different part, I would love for you to go back and try it again because it's a lot of fun to play music over and over again. Get better at it and have more fun. All right, that's it for today, talking about beat and rhythm. We'll see you next time, and I hope you're having a musical day. I wish you well. Bye.